This is all embroidery. Hi guys, so the weather is changing and I feel like buying some summer clothes, like some light cotton tops or something like that. And I was looking online at like Madewell and I was like, maybe I'll just try to go look for something in Korea. So we're gonna go to express bus terminal and just look around for some new summer clothes. Have Valentina with me. <laughs> so let's see what's in what's uh, what's new for summer in Korea. Just missed the express train. So to go to the underground shopping terminal, you go to exit 81 or 82. And it looks like you should be going that way, because that's all it. But if you go this way, you can just go directly to the you can go directly to the underground terminal and just sort of bypass the other stuff and not get lost. You follow these arrows towards X81 and X2. You can enter the shopping mall through a number of ways. So that looks cute and like nice and airy for summer. But I'm right at the entrance and I think a really good price, but um, I'm gonna keep looking around. When I'm here, I like to just look at everything first. I'll just take a walk around, and then usually towards the end, away from the main entrance, you'll have better prices. Um, but I feel like ten, like some of the shirts I saw were 10,000 won, and I feel like I probably won't get a better price than that for um, clothing. So I'll probably end up going back there, but I just want to look around and see what there is before I buy anything. So what I'm looking for are sort of just some light summer cotton tops and also um, like a set that has matching shorts and also a tank top um, that are kind of lightweight and summery for the summer. I saw this dress. I did give a dinosaur too? Yeah, if she wants it. She wants it. So I saw this dress from last season that was like more than I wanted to pay, but I saw it today for a 29,000 won, which is a really good deal. So I went ahead and got it. been walking forever but there's still all of this that we have to go through. So I 
think we're right by the main entrance, which is why some of those shirts that I saw for uh, for 10,000 won earlier were 15,000 won right here, because it's right by the, the main entrance. Guys, I decided to come home and eat lunch because um, I could eat a little bit healthier and I could also put Valentina for a nap in her bed and while she's napping I can either take a nap with her or get some work done like edit videos for my channel so I figured that would be better than eating at express bus terminal and then just coming home and having to pick up Sienna right away. So for lunch, um, spinach with a fried egg over brown rice and seaweed. There's the brown rice. And then Latina, she ate most of her rice with seaweed and is also having some cucumbers and sesame <sighs> dressing. <sighs> Hi guys, so I got um, three tops and two dresses. I got three tops and two dresses and I spent 70,000 won, which is about, or 69,000 won, which is about seven, maybe like 65 US dollars. But I've never done this before, so I'm just gonna try on some of my pieces and show you what I got. So I'll start with this dress. I saw this last summer and I wanted to buy it, but it was really expensive, so I ended up not buying it, but it was on sale today for 29,000 won, which is about 20-something US dollars, like $28. So... This is all embroidery. It's all embroidered. Here's the next dress that I bought. It's a little bit shapeless, but it feels really cool. The fabric, it's... Seems like it's a linen. It smells a little bit funny. Like, but it feels really light and cool. I think this is going to be really comfortable during the summer. So I really like the length of the dress. It's a really modest length that's great for moms. Just right above the knee. And I think I'm going to get a lot of use out of this. I got this at the same shop that I got the dark blue dress at. The plain dark blue dress. And it's a similar style, but it's just shorter. And it ties in the back with a bow. This shirt just feels so light and cooling. I know it's gonna be perfect for summer. This shirt that I got for about ten dollars. You can see the sleeve, and it's a nice loose-fitting mom top. This is my last top. It's very flowy and loose-fitting, and it's mustard yellow color. So this is a little bit shorter than I would have liked and it's not as cool and like, you know, airy as the other tops. So that's what I got. Um, I feel like I got quite a good deal on everything. I was only gonna buy like two or three tops but I ended up buying those dresses as well. Um, everything was $10 except for this dress. This was 29 but everything else was 10 or 10,000 won, which is quite a steal in my opinion. And I think like after trying them on, I think I'm really gonna like, this one is the most comfortable and the lightest and the best for summer. And this is my second favorite top. And then this one I'm kind of like regretting buying. But the thing about um, shopping at places like this is you can't usually try on the clothes and they only have one size so it's one size fits all. 
um, and one size doesn't always fit everyone. So this is like a little bit more balloony than I would have liked and it's not as breathable. But this one seems like it's going to be really light and comfortable during the summer. And this one like actually cools my skin when it touches it. So I love this top. It's so like, it's so light and so cooling. So I think this is real linen, which for 10, 10 bucks for real linen is not bad. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. I don't do a lot of shopping like this. I don't remember the last time that I went out and bought so many clothes. But I was there on a mission to buy things and I had a plan. And now that I've been living in Seoul for a year, I feel a little more experienced. And at a lot of places where they sell things for like 10, they sell like shirts or like dresses for 10,000 won, you're not gonna be able to bargain with them much, I think. Um, maybe if you buy a lot of pieces you can, but 10 bucks is already pretty cheap for these tops. Um, on the other hand, if you're going to places where they sell like stuff like this, for like higher prices, you maybe you could probably bargain with them more. But I'm really not an expert on bargaining, that's just how I do it. I actually hate to bargain uh, because I'm terrible at it and like a lot of times I just forget that you're supposed to bargain in Korea. But um, today I came away feeling good because most of the things I bought were the prices were like marked on the um, the clothing rack and when the prices are marked like that like it makes me feel like oh um, and the price is pretty cheap it makes me kind of feel like oh everyone must be paying this price but then it's at those places where you over well I can understand a lot of Koreans so when I overhear other customers saying like I'll give you this much or like let's like when I hear other cu customers trying to wheel and deal then I feel like oh like that's a place where I should be bargaining too but at uh, most of the places where I shopped um, I overheard other customers and they were just paying, they are just like, well, let me have two of these and then the lady says it's 20,000 won so they just pay her that and that's what you would expect at a uh, price like 10,000 won per shirt. So that's what I got. Um, let me know, have you guys ever shopped at these markets before? I really don't shop a lot, um, I don't know why but I just... Recently, I just felt like buying new clothes for the summer because I wanted some cool cotton tops. And so I went and got some. <laughs> Leave me a comment below if you like this video. Give me a thumbs up. And I'll talk to you next time. Bye!